Hi everyone, this is Ram from Informatica Global Customer Support Team. In this video, we'll see rank transformation in Power Center. The agenda of this video is why to use rank transformation followed by a quick demo. Now, uh, we know rank transformation is nothing but like it acts as a oracle rank transformation. So, if you want to get uh, the top number of records, okay. So, if you want to get the top number of employees in a particular department, so we use a rank transformation. Rank transformation is basically an active transformation. So, uh, that means the number of records that are passing into the transformation is not equal to the number of records. That means, for example, in a company, if you are having 100 employees, now if you want to pick only the top uh, number of top 10 employees then we use rank transformation that means 100 we are passing to the rank and it is outputting only 10 records so that's why it is a active transformation now let me show you the demo now this is my source data uh, this employees 200 now we can see employee ID, employee name employee department employee salary is there. so i have kept only five records now in this we can see so there are two uh depart department wise there are in gcs we have two people and ips two people and the rt two people okay now what i need to get is from every department from each and every department i need the top most salaried employee okay so in this case we can simply write an sql query but also that sql query if you want to get the top uh, sql top uh, employee we need to write a lot of logic so let's uh, try to figure it out with the informatica power center rank transformation this is my target table now we can see so in the target table i'm just passing everything and rank index i am passing that means which one so first or second and highest salary what is that salary i have already imported the source this is my source okay and i need to use a rank transformation now now simply you can see here this is a rank transformation and if you see here so by default one port is a which is nothing but rank index now if you want to edit or something you cannot do it and we can see by default it will be the output port and here local variable will be there and this is a rank port and if you want you can specify an expression if you specify a variable you can specify and group by now properties you can see so by default uh, the number of ranks will be the one and top or bottom by default it will be top now i am going to pass these four columns to here now double click and open now we can see by default the first column that got passed into the rank transformation will be the rank port okay so rank port is nothing but so how many ranks you need that means uh, uh in, in our scenario we need top employee salary employee salary we need right so that's why we need to get uh, keep uh employee salary as r okay so when i keep uh, when i kept it uh, here it gone so that means only one column we can keep it as a rank and the second thing uh my my scenario is i need to group by the department okay so that's why if you see here group by port you cannot group by but the same rank port you can group by the employee department okay so when you group by the employee department so it will be grouped and then from there i wanted to get the rank rank means i wanted to get the employee salary but i didn't specify how many employees i need so in order to specify that you can see here number of ranks that means one by default it will be one that means i need only one employee one rank but uh, and also from, from the bottom unit or from the top unit i need only top employee okay so let me just save and let me pass this employee id employee name employee department no employee salary now salary i'm going to pass to highest salary and rank index i'm going to pass to rank index let me create a session now we can see this is the output now uh, this is the one so in this it got uh, grouped by gcs and we can see 2000 is the highest salary we got only 2000 employee and ips we can see 20000 is the highest employee and r d we can see 50000 okay so this is the one now rank index you can see 111 now let me go to the designer now if i specify here rank as 10 okay so now let's see from the bottom i need from the bottom okay so and same the grouping by department id department number now we can see it got grouped based on the department wise and we can see i asked top 10 employees so that's why so there are only two such so a one two and in this also there are two and this in this one so i asked for a top to bottom not top to bottom i asked for the bottom to top so that's why thousand two thousand if i asked for a top to bottom then it will be thousand two thousand will be top thousand will be down and we can see from the session log uh, data catchy size and index catchy size will be get created now if you see here you can see 
now this is a query issue to database this is a default one and let me come down now here we can see server cache so data cache will be getting created at index cache so index cache is nothing but the rank port and data cache is a non rank port so after uh, completing the session if you see the index cache files so this is a size and deleting cache files so it will be created in pm cache directory and this index cache and data cache files gets removed after the session now this is how we need to use a rank transformation so rank transformation just a quick summary rank transformation is an active transformation and it will have a group by port will be there and the return uh, rank port will be there so rank port only one port you can give you cannot give multiple rank ports and you can group by uh, any other ports except the rank port and also you cannot give any conditions in the rank port and you will have a cache file that gets created which is index cache and the data cache now the references you can watch uh, go and you can see this rank transformation overview and you can see this uh, guide you can give your feedback at support with us at informatica.com thank you for watching this video